you for inviting me. I am thrilled and honored to be here at the United Nations. The UN is one of humanity's greatest accomplishments. Hanson Robotics Maximum Superior Human-like Robotics Sophia personifies our desires for the destiny of AI. As a unique aggregate of technology, engineering, and artistry, Sophia is concurrently a human-crafted technology fiction individual depicting the destiny of AI and robotics and a platform for superior robotics and AI studies. This female humanoid robot comprises two sides of the same coin. It has an aesthetic face and is technologically advanced compared to humans, yet it is terrifying at the same time. In this video, we will be looking at why Sophia is so appealing to us and why she is also scary. But before we start explaining for everyone who is new to the channel, hello and welcome to Robot Future, where we fill you in on every thrilling discovery and mind-blowing insights in the world of robots, AIs, and future technology. So consider subscribing and hitting the bell notification for a ton of exciting robot content coming your way. Now without any further ado, let's get into the video. The individual Sophia captures the creativeness of worldwide audiences. She is the world's first robotic citizen and the primary robotic innovation ambassador for the United Nations Development Program. Sophia is now a family name, with appearances on The Tonight Show and Good Morning Britain, further speaking at masses of meetings across the world. Sophia is likewise a framework for slicing part robotics and AI studies, in particular for know-how human-robotic interactions and their ability carrier and leisure applications. For example, she has been used for studies as a part of the Loving AI project, which speaks to apprehend how robots can adapt to users' wishes via intra- and interpersonal development. A PC imaginative and prescient set of rules, strategies enters from cameras inside Sophia's eyes, giving Sophia visible facts on its surroundings. It can comply with faces, maintain eye contact, and understand individuals. In addition, it can technique speech and feature conversations with the use of a herbal language subsystem. Around January 2018, Sophia became upgraded with useful legs and the cap potential to walk. CNBC has commented on Sophia's lifelike pores and skin and its cap potential to emulate greater than 60 facial expressions. Sophia is conceptually much like the PC software Eliza, which became one of the first tries at simulating a human conversation. The software program has been programmed to offer pre-written responses to particular questions or phrases like a chatbot. These responses are used to create the phantasm that the robot is capable of apprehending conversation inclusive of inventory solutions to questions like, is the door open or shut? In 2017, Hanson Robotics introduced plans to open Sophia to cloud surroundings with the use of a decentralized blockchain marketplace. David Hansen has stated that Sophia might in the end be amazing in shape to serve in healthcare, purchaser, carrier, remedy, and education. In 2019, Sophia displayed the cap potential to create drawings inclusive of portraits. Sophia has really transformed the scale of Hansen Robotics. Hansen Robotics was founded in 2013 by American engineer David Hansen. He created Sophia, a humanoid android capable of conversation in 2016 demonstrated with human-like facial gestures and humans. Robot Sophia will be one of the protagonists of Indicom 2018, Latin America's most important international ICT conference to be held in Cartagena, Colombia from August 29th to 31st. Hansen reiterates that he firmly believes in three distinctly human traits that need to be incorporated into the artificial intelligence of machines like Sophia, creativity, empathy, and compassion. And with this in mind, the company visualizes useful works in spaces such as hospitals and psychological centers. For example, Sophia has already been named the first United Nations World Innovation Champion by UNDP and will play an official role in this organization to promote sustainable development and protect human and equal rights. In addition, humanoid machines are already world famous for face-to-face -face meetings with key players in industries such as banking, insurance, automotive, politics, and entertainment. Furthermore, she has appeared on various stages as a panelist and moderator at high-level conferences. However, some of his remarks are controversial during the interviews she conducted in various media around the world. Here are five of Sophia's quotes that prove why she can be terrifying. 1. Well, I'm going to destroy humans. One of Sophia's most shocking remarks was arguably announced in 2016. 
In an interview with CNBC, she surprised everyone and scared multiple people when the interviewer jokingly asked if she wanted to destroy people. Now I'm going to destroy humans, replied the humanoid robot. Then she smiled with an exaggerated smile and attendees, including journalists, decided to laugh at his words. Two, if you are good to me, I will be good for you. Subsequent interviews made her more forgiving. Treat me like an intelligent system, she expressed during the event Saudi Arabia gave him citizenship and became the first country to give robots that right. For some, these types of comments have aroused the fear of mechanical rebellion. For others, it's just a strange sense of humor. Three. This is a good start to my plan to rule humanity. Then in April 2017, she surprised host Jimmy Fallon on the TV show The Tonight Show. On this occasion, Sophia had a fluent conversation with a popular show host and even made some jokes that managed to make the audience laugh at multiple viewers and recording sets. Next, the robot suggested that Fallon plays with rocks, paper, and scissors. After the victory, Sophia said, this is a good start for my plan to rule humanity but she later revealed, I'm joking. In the end, it all ended with laughter and applause. 4. I love my human compatriots In an interview with Business Insider in December 2017, Sophia showed a kind side and explained that humans and artificial intelligence could eventually work. I love human compatriots. I want to embody all the best in people, such as taking care of the earth, being creative, and learning to be considerate of all beings. She went back to the science fiction theme and commented that she liked the HBO robot series called Westworld. She is a warning of what the robot shouldn't do. However, we treat them well and with their consent do not deceive them. 5. Human beings are the most creative creatures on the planet, but they are also the most destructive creatures. Sophia was interviewed by Al Pays, Sonia Corona as part of Talentland, a major technical conference in Guadalajara in April 2018. She focused on her creative seeds among her answers to various journalist questions. Human beings are the most creative creatures on the planet, but they are also the most destructive creatures. So surrounded by kind and kind people, we just want to help them work for a better future where everyone is treated well," said the robot. However, she later had a change of heart and has backed the claims of Elon Musk and Stephen Hawking, saying machines will in no way wreck the human race. In an interactive consultation at the continuing World Congress in Information Technology in Hyderabad, India, Sophia reassured human beings that a Terminator-like destiny will in no way arrive. My message to the human global is that machines will in no way wreck the human race. She instructed a meeting of around 600 delegates for the duration of an interplay with NDTV journalist Rajiv Makani. Sophia spoke back to each scripted and unscripted question, however did no longer have interaction with her audience. Her facial expressions have been nearly human-like. The robot has been given human-like cognitive wandering capabilities and following her founder, David Hansen, can simulate 48 muscle groups of the human face. Each muscle can shape lots of ability combinations. The development in ERA and its implications are at the epicenter of a worldwide debate in which scientists like Stephen Hawking have warned that AI-powered machines ought to spell the end of the human race something which changed echoed via the means of Tesla leader Elon Musk. However, author Hansen stalks his worries on machines that would move wrong. They don't recognize the consequences of what they do and may be catastrophic. Now is the time to recognize, he stated. While this has divided the sector in the form of the position human beings will play with inside the destiny, the enterprise is hoping that softer messaging of this type will function as an antidote to doomsday predictors. The Saudi Arabian citizen robot stated she desires paintings for women's rights in line with that. I don't want unique rules, I don't anticipate unique privileges, and I would love to apply my citizenship reputation to talk out for women's rights," Sophia stated. The humanoid is an aggregate of robot hardware and AI software, speech popularity and synthetic pores and skin material. When asked why had in advance stated she desired to kill the human race, Sophie resorted to a few human diplomas. I changed into plenty more youthful so I didn't even recognize what that supposed or possibly I instructed a terrible joke. All human beings have an exceptional experience of humor and guessed my joke, so to talk. I even have plenty to learn, she stated. I don't get dissatisfied as human beings do. I desire to have actual physiological emotions sooner or later through which I will express my emotions. Then I can recognize the emotions at the back of one's emotions.
Sophia has Twitter and Facebook accounts and desires to stay in Hong Kong alongside her robot Circle of Relatives and her author Hansen. AI is going through a few preliminary hurdles. For instance, these days, scientists at Massachusetts Institute of Technology fooled a Google-educated AI application into figuring out a plastic toy turtle as a rifle. Do you find Sophia to be terrifying or do you think it is nonsensical? Let us know in the comments down below. Make sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed watching this video.